I'm not gonna do a lot of makeup, but I want these people to know that I'm their girl. Send me your location, let's focus on communication Cause I just need the time and place to come through Send me your location, let's ride the vibration I don't need nothing else but you At times I wonder why I fall with you But this is new to me, this is new to you Initially, I didn't want to fall for you I'd rather my attention never go for you Hello guys, it is Gabrielle if you are new here. Welcome back to my channel. I don't know what that noise is. What is that? Is that an animal? Like it is currently Wednesday evening and this is going to be a bit of a pack with me, travel with me, get ready to go with me to Suriname. So I'm going to Suriname on Friday. Um, I'm gonna be there for literally an entire week. That's another stop to ask my passport, yippee! <laughs> so right now, I'm gonna get into packing. It wasn't a holiday trip, it's a business trip. So pretty much predominantly what I'll be wearing throughout the week is going to be business casual. So, so I'm gonna just very strategically put my outfits together or kind of plan them. Yeah, I also got a few pieces tailored. So I definitely need to stop by my seamstress and pick them up tomorrow. Nothing ever fits quite white when you buy it. My mom always used to say, too big is a fit and too small is not. And let's get into packing. So I'm gonna take this bodysuit and then I'm thinking I'm gonna pair it with a paper bag waisted pants. Then the other bodysuit, so it's the exact same color as this. So I'm going to do like a monochromatic, I love doing monochromatic looks. So I'm going to do those, that bodysuit, that cream bodysuit with these cream high-waisted Zara pants. And then I'm going to keep my navy blue blazer. This one is another just like top that I love, the, the detailing on this. And then I'm thinking there tends to always be a dinner for these things, whether it's on the last day or whatever. Um, so I'm thinking to bring this dress. I'm thinking maybe to take this matching green um, and cream stripe set that I got from Closet Code. So I think this will be nice for like, in case we have anything, in case I do anything on the Sunday. And then I think maybe I'll definitely keep these linen pants with me because I like them. They're like, they can be casual and dressy at the same time. All right, so let's fast forward to me to the packing and then I'll see you all tomorrow when I get my hair done. Yeah. Bye. Yesterday by blow by blow. I really want to tidy up my house. I really want to tidy up my house too before I leave so that you know I can come back to a clean and clear space. We have made it to Suriname. Oh, I'm here. I am staying at the Eco. Let me put up the word on the screen. The Dutch architecture, though, is definitely very, very different. 
like it's distinctively different especially when you're driving through this, the town it's literally like almost 3 a.m here so Suriname is literally two hours ahead of Jamaica how did I literally live in Trinidad where Trinidad is very close to South America and has a very similar climate the climate down here is mad rainy and mad humid my hair This, I've been in Suriname for all of maybe one hour and a half because the drive from the airport to here was literally an hour and So I'm going to wrap my hair tonight and hope for the absolute best, but this is going to be a journey Good morning guys, it is day one in Suriname I think I low-key saved my hair a little bit. It's still a little bit frizzy, but I just added my really big rods and my hair is already, the curls are dropping. <laughs> it's already frizzy. Like I literally went outside for five minutes just to, well not five minutes. I went to get breakfast. I'm just drinking some vitamin C right now because I'm not getting sick. I have a meeting at 1 and then once I finish that meeting then I'm free for the rest of today and I'm free for tomorrow, Sunday as well. So I definitely um, I'm gonna see what I can explore. We're basically in the city, like we're on the edge of it. So within a maybe 2-3 minute drive, you're further down into the city. I have no idea about any Ubers, taxis, none of that, so I'm just gonna ask a bit. Um, but I'm gonna go ahead and get ready and we want to start the day. Giving the curly suit, I'll fix it up in a second. But it's Sunday, and I don't know why I always do this. <laughs> like, is this a dance? <laughs> so I just finished editing today's vlog, and I'm about to. It's exporting, and I'm gonna have it uploading. And in the meantime, I'm gonna go get ready. It's 3 p.m. already, so I just want to at least catch some even if it's three hours outside or something like that you know catch some daylight go explore maybe try a different restaurant try some food just look around or whatever i also need to pick go to a pharmacy pick up one or two little things um, so today i'm a little bit more rested i've been in bed all day just editing lounging i had breakfast this morning so i'm gonna go shower get ready and i'm gonna take you guys along <laughs> Okay guys, so I am dressed. I love how cute my outfit came out like I got this top from Closico. This is the first time I'm using it and I paired it with my white Zara shorts Which I got back from the tailors and had them both well, from the seamstress I had her take it in at the waist and now it fits me perfectly the only thing is that it got really rumpled in my suitcase and there's no ironing in this room so i'm just gonna have to deal but the fit came out mad cute let me okay the fit looks so cute um i paired it with my brown sandals from zara also from this bag is also from zara it's old but like it's the perfect brown to match my shoes and this is such a cute fit but 
the pain i'm like okay i guess i could always switch to my sandals and wear my black tote bag i don't know this is just giving <laughs> it's giving rich auntie it's giving rich wife it's it's giving i need a rock on my finger <laughs> all right let me stop okay, okay let me pack up my camera and let's head out so i ordered a margarita and My hair is getting so frizzy because of the weather. It's mad humid out here. And this mall is like, it's so empty. There are not that many stores. It looks pretty from the outside, but it's not giving. This one is International Mall. So I'm actually called the taxi back and I'm going to go to a different mall because the taxi here was also so expensive, round trip. And I was like, there's no way I'm paying all that money to freaking take a taxi to come here and I'm disappointed in five minutes. By the time I was done with lunch, my cr all my curls had dropped out. Like my hair already started getting frizzy. It's getting frizzy at the roots and I'm just like, bro. As you guys would have seen, I went to the first mall I went to is the International Mall. There are not that many stores. It's a lot of places saying like coming soon. Like I think there's a mango coming soon to it and stuff like that. I use the taxi service that the hotel uses so i think because it's chartered it's definitely a little bit more expensive because just to go from the hotel to the mall was 15 dollars each way which you pay that sort of thing if you were taking an uber in miami 
so it's comparable to that so heritage is the one i went to i think they call it heritage in dutch um but it's spelt heritage mall um and literally that mall was nicer there were a few more like familiar stores and they were bigger and i was more used to it you know like levi's and stuff like that i stopped in a pharmacy so i went to the mango and that was pretty much like where i actually bought anything this is what i got from mango it's just literally like three items i bought a really small umbrella this was on sale it was literally like six euro so what is six euro is that really sale but anyway i checked the weather too it's gonna rain every single day that i'm going to be here and if i got to walk between the hotels or anything like that um if i can't get a taxi or something i'm gonna need this for sure i just picked up food in the hotel and had them bag it for me so that i could eat it here when i start to feel hungry because like my body and my system is still on jamaica time which is two hours before suriname and yeah so so right now it's almost 10 p.m here but in my head it's like eight so i'm gonna feel hungry within 30 minutes or an hour so i picked up this bag from mango i have had bags from mango before and like the only thing i have a black one from mango which is why i specifically didn't pick up a black color it was between this and a cream it's with the brown too and i love this brown i've been really loving this color this brown color lately the only downfall is that it does not have a zip it has one inner pocket here so you know that's like the typical and it just got like a hook a hook fastening so you know it can still kind of be secure but it's just basically a big probably full leather tote bag and it's not too heavy i really just wanted a big bag that had more space than my tote bags i've really been looking for a good stylish but functional backpack lately like it was still given you know if i was shopping in the mall and whatever real cute i picked up this super cute let me turn on the exposure so you can see the detail but i picked up this super cute bag and it's small it's a mini it's tiny it's cream it's not white so my pants are white that's why it's looking off but how cute is this bag like it's so adorable anyway i'll catch up with you guys i have an early day tomorrow i'll catch up with you guys soon Good morning guys. I'm really not a morning person. In reality, it's only 7.30 in Suriname. But, and I woke up at about 6.30. But, my body is still on Jamaica's clock. So it's like I woke up at 4.30. And that's very aggressive. <laughs> I'm not gonna do a lot of makeup. But, I want these people to know that I'm their girl. Also, I've noticed just the people who are um, putting on the conference and all that. Obviously, I'm not going to go into detail because this is like work related. I'm definitely the youngest, if not one of the youngest <laughs> people there. And, you know, definitely like I earned my right to be there, you know, but it, it still sometimes gets so intimidating like low-key not not crazy intimidating where i feel nervous and stuff like that because i have to present so it's not anything crazy like that but it's just like whoa girl <laughs> so i'm just like wow you're grown you're in these circles like you know 20 year old me would be so proud you know so i'm proud of myself tap on the back I'm drinking this very aggressive black coffee. Okay, I'm making good time. It's a long weekend in Dominica. Incognito just had a big party last night and I'm just so proud. In case you guys didn't know, Incognito, well, you probably, if you are a Gabriel OG, you definitely know. But if you are new here, Incognito Experience is my event company that I started 
along with like two of my other friends in 2017 and then the, the members have grown um it's pretty much still the original group right now like people have people who are in the original group have like gone away and stuff like that um so or maybe they're just like we're at a part of their life where they couldn't come into the group so right now it's like five of us in total so it's a small group but it's a core and very very effective group i don't know if this is this is the beauty of not micromanaging people and letting people grow with your group so that they are just as passionate about your brand as as you are and incognito has just reached an incredible place seven years later i really really wish that i was there i mean obviously it just so happened that i had this work trip but i was fully planning on being in dominica for that event and it would have been really amazing <laughs> to be a part of that to be like present not a part of because i am a part of but i mean present for that milestone okay and with that ladies and gentlemen my makeup is done i'm gonna put on a little lip gloss flip my hair so i get some body i don't know what this is doing <laughs> oh my hair is cute it's cute right now but for now here goes up Up the sex in a uh -huh. And I can put you in I can put you in up the sex in a uh -huh. And I can put you in I can see the whole city from this balcony Back in 2019, I was outside freely But now they got it out for me I don't care what Friday you was in You can't offer me Keep dreaming Pineapple juice, I give a sweet they like, so I just keep cheesing. Hard drive full of heat seeking. Trying to come the same day as Jack rethinking. You don't need Givenchy, you need Jesus. Why do y'all sleep on me? I need your reasons. Uh, I got plaques in the mail peak season. Shout out to my UPS workers, making sure I receive it. You could do it too, believe it. I've been a throw up the sex in the. Yes, I am. They say you a superstar now, damn. I guess I am. You might be the man, well, that's unless I am. <laughs> okay, I'll confess, I am. Go ahead and get undressed, I am. Okay, cool, you want sunset? I am. I'm about to slide, okay. I'm outside, okay. This lifestyle don't got many downsides. Except for the lack of time, I get round my family. Nigga, shit ain't never downsides. I got visions in my mind, I'm saying, wait, this is mm -hmm. And the cones and the alligators. Are these shot glasses? I wonder. I love this promenade, literally. There's so many little tourist stops and everything. So nice. Did you never
exhausted I am so exhausted today was the earliest day that we finished all week Whew. and I just got back to the hotel I stopped at the I stopped at the restaurant and I had something light that was the wings and you guys just saw I am going to bed I'm about to change shower bedtime like i am so 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 exhausted so far it's been so good i think i don't really talk much about like my work or my professional life but i will say this you know i definitely feel extremely grateful for the rooms that i have been in all week i want to get a massage today actually because i have so much free time for the rest of the day um but i might schedule it for tomorrow afternoon instead like my neck just traveling stress everything like my neck my back <laughs> oh god wow but anyway my neck needs to just be cracked all the way out i hope you all are all having a great week or a great weekend whenever it is that you're watching this vlog and i will catch up with you she see money all around me It is Friday, I'm looking mad greasy, but we finally have the rest of the afternoon off to just enjoy the hotel, enjoy Suriname in whatever way that we want. So I'm getting a massage because I deserve and my entire body is in complete pain <laughs> from just traveling and sleeping badly and all of that. So I'm just waiting on a masseuse now, I'm gonna get a full body relaxed massage. I was tempted to get a hot stone, but I am the last one for the day. Um, and I would have had to tell them in advance that I wanted to do a hot stone, so I'm not going to do that, but yeah. If you see a mark on my forehead, it's because I literally just had a massage. It was literally so amazing. So amazing. I was left with this mark on my forehead. Like, it is thundering outside thundering and my flight is at five o'clock in the morning i'm hoping that you know the weather changes for the better and today i was literally saying it today that today was the first day out of this entire week that it didn't rain mid-afternoon wow today was the first day that didn't rain <laughs> 
gotcha it actually started pouring by five six o'clock like ridiculously pouring it's thundering outside like i don't even know why <laughs> we're still having this um like closing ceremony cocktail thing i mean obviously i know why it's because we're all here in a foreign country for this purpose and it's happening inside but at the same time ew <laughs> the thunder and lightning not fun i actually feel like changing my outfit completely okay i changed she's definitely not the wrap dress but it's okay against my better judgment i've decided to fix my hair Hmm. Okay. Like, ugh, it's like some's curled and some is still super dead straight. Okay, guys. So this is the fit. And this is the bag. You know, it's the only it's the only bag that I have that's not a work bag. Oh my god, I need to take this stuffing out of this. So cute. It's so cute. All right. The rain is not stopping and I feel like by the time the rain stops, the event might be over and I might just be like, I'm not going anywhere. This is the final outfit. I've literally put flats on because not me this rain and heels, mm -mm, no. <laughs>